Hello friends, family, welcome once again as we say adieu, a fond farewell, the elms that were recovered from the crawl space but aren't fit to be played again. The covers look great, the vinyl does not look great. I already have a couple Gene Pitney albums. Same with the Hendrix. I have Hendrix. I would like to have saved this one, but uh, the cover's pretty bad and the vinyl is equally as bad. Volume 2. Brutal. I have a decent copy of this. I wish I could have saved this, but I uh, can't save it. That's Domino. The vinyl. I have a, at least one or two better copies of the Four Seasons. I wish I could have saved this one. I have so many Elvis albums. I kept a couple of the better ones, the vinyls, just brutal, the inside's nice, the album's jacket's nice, but another badly beat up Elvis album, I can actually see the, the mold on that. Harem Scarum. The vinyl is Harem Scarum. After I'm done handling these, I'm going to wash my hands with the sanitizer because they're pretty bad. Chubby could not be saved. Had your last twist. Teenagers have mistreated these albums. Pass them around to your friends too many times. Nobody's really looked after you. And you've been in my crawl space for 15 years. That looks so immaculate, but the vinyl is just a mess. Nothing but static. Nothing but static. But Benton, <laughs> just as bad inside as the outside. Again, I had so many Beach Boys albums, I didn't know which one to save, but it wasn't hard to decide because these are, that one's a mess. So is Barry McGuire. Baby, I'm yours. Not anymore, you're not. You're going to Goodwill, along with all your, your buddies over here. One of these times, I'm going to save a batch of the ones that I saved that were rescued. These guys, it's out of here. Anyway, take care. We'll see you next time.